Hi, hello, good morning, good afternoon, good evening, whatever time of day this video is finding you. Welcome to Barely Grace. My name is Grace and I started this YouTube channel um, as well as a Facebook group of the same name to promote self-care, uh, the importance of self-care and uh, kind of to encourage that and to hold each other accountable um, to ensure that we are doing self-care. Um, most of my videos do focus around skincare, hair care, and makeup, but I may from time to time talk about other things as well and how they relate back to self-care. So if that is something that interests you, ah, I encourage you to like and subscribe. You can also share this video with other people. Um, and join us on Facebook um, because we do have a lot of fun in the group. Uh, welcome. I'm glad. Uh, I'm glad that you're here with me. Um, let's see. What am I drinking? I'm drinking. I have a couple of options here. Um, when we went to the store earlier and went shopping, um, I got this Red Bull. Here's my Jeffree Star um, stainless steel straw. So there's a little bit left in that. Um, I, of course, am drinking water. I think this is my like my third or fourth one of these today, and these are 16 ounces. So doing pretty good on that. And then I just made a smoothie. Um, in the smoothie, I used I used this. I picked this up when we were at the store. Um, this is Immunity Boost. Um, this is ginger and turmeric. And black pepper <laughs> um, it's a shot so it's meant to all be drank at one time um, I did have like a little taste of it and I actually gave my husband a little taste of it um, before I started making the smoothie and there was there's no way that I could drink the entirety of this just by itself like all in one shot it was really intense um, of course ginger is a really intense flavor turmeric can be as well when you put black pepper in with it, like it really like shocks you. And while I was making the smoothie, and of course I put that in the smoothie, um, my husband was like, "Actually, that's not too bad." Like it took him, like he would, like the initial shock of it will get you. Um, and then after a few minutes, he was like, "You know what? That's not too bad." So this smoothie, I used the Immunity Boost. Um, I used a banana. Uh, some raspberries, some frozen blueberries that I had. Um, I used some of a, like a mango, like a mango juice drink um, that was left over in the fridge from when my oldest had um, their wisdom tea taken out. And then I think I put a little bit of like applesauce in it, like un unsweetened applesauce. I wanted some spinach, but we didn't have any. I should have got some at the store, and I didn't think about it. Um, but this smoothie's really good. It's it's definitely got a very mango flavor. Oh, and it, of course, it's got ice in it. And I think I put some mango sorbet in here, too, because we had some, like, natural mango sorbet. But it's good. It's good. I do enjoy smoothies. Um, I don't make them a lot. I don't know why. Uh, I just probably because I um, I just drink water and coffee all the time and occasionally a Red Bull. But um, I'm doing a self-care challenge in my group, uh, Barely Grace, on Facebook. And today was Make Yourself a Smoothie. So I decided to make myself a smoothie. Still doing the February water challenge. Um, my friend Ashley is doing that. Um... So yeah, that'll be linked below. Definitely want to make sure that you get your water in. Um, today is going to be a unboxing. Uh, actually, it's a haul. It's more of a haul. Um, I do have one package from Ipsy, and I know what's in here. And I've actually had it for a couple days, and I didn't do a video on it. I was going to wait until I got some more Ipsy stuff so I could do it all in one time. Um, but since I'm doing a haul today of things I've gotten from Amazon and things I picked up at the store today, I just figured I would throw the Ipsy in here. This is a product I've talked about before. Uh, it was something that I was running low on, so I got a new one. This is from a company called Freck Beauty. 
This is the Freck OG, uh, the original Freckle. This is a Freckle pen, and I have one, and I love it, absolutely love it. And so I was like, I need another one. And this popped up in an Ipsy, like for an add-on. And I was like, oh, well, let me just add another one on. This is what, this is what the tube, the packaging looks like. Um, I don't think it says really, a uh, long wear freckle makeup. Um, <clears throat> I'll show you what it looks like. I'm not going to put any on today, uh, or not right now at least, but it's just kind of like a, I don't even want to do it because <laughs> but it's just like a little, almost like a paintbrush. It's so hard for that to pick up on camera. I mean, it's seriously like only a couple of hairs. Um, and then I'll show you from what I put on my hand. Once you have it on, uh oh, you just kind of like tap over it. It's not going to do that great on my hand. Anyway, um, I'll do a tutorial of how you do it on the face um, when I decide to do my makeup and do the freckles. But I absolutely love it. I adore freckles. I've talked about this before. I do have some, uh, not a lot, not as many as I would like. Um, and so when I do my makeup, those tend to go away. So I enjoy a freckle pen. Okay, so that's the Ipsy out of the way. Oh, yesterday I woke up and I had a lot of spoons. <laughs> I felt great yesterday when I woke up. Um, and so I was like, let me, um, let me take advantage of how great I'm feeling. I was already off work because it was my youngest's birthday and I had taken off um, for her birthday. And... I hadn't been feeling well like all week so when I woke up on Friday and I felt great I was like I need to do something with this and so I actually took a couple gummies and then took a pain pill just so I would continue to feel good because like I knew that there was going to be some pain in my jaw uh, as the day kind of progressed and so I did that and then I started cleaning and I cleaned from like nine o'clock yesterday morning until like nine o'clock last night um and not like the entire time but like i completely cleaned off my desk like my desk looks amazing like everything is organized i put things where i wanted them you can see there's all kinds of new stuff um there's my big pusheen so uh, my hello kitty and these unicorns they were normally on my desk but i moved them um, this normally would hang over here on my door of uh, all this stuff moved all these things and then let me turn on this side you can see my big pusheen um, but yeah so I completely cleaned my office my entire desk uh, everywhere else in my office of course you can't see the rest of it because this partition is here um, and then I added things to the partition and moved things around and just kind of reorganized and decluttered. I dusted everything, vacuumed. I did all that um, in the office. And then also, like, went through some of my, uh, like, clothes in my dresser. Um, completely cleaned the, uh, our bedroom and, like, reorganized it and all that. So, yeah, that was great. Yesterday was a great day. Wonderful day. Got that deep clean out of the way. Spring cleaning, I guess. Um, so, yeah. Love that. Love that for me. Okay, so I will talk about a couple of things that we picked up at the store um, when we went shopping earlier. And then also, I got like four things in from Amazon today. We got a big, like, I think we got a total of like eight or nine things from Amazon today. Um, so I got a couple of those, so I'll talk about those. Um, I guess I will do, I'll talk about my husband's stuff first, um, because it's things that I personally don't use, my husband uses and loves and would 100% recommend. Um, this is Dr. Squatch, and my husband started using the Dr. Squatch maybe like a year and a half two years ago something like that he's been using it for a while 
and they sell it at Walmart now for a long time he can only buy it like on their website or on like Amazon or something like that but they sell it in Walmart now um, this is the Fresh Falls um, but they also have a lot of like pine tar is one that I, the scent of it is absolutely wonderful I love it but this Fresh Falls is really good too and then like they have this little um, they have the little hole so that when you're in the store if you want to like smell one you can um, usually these are over like in the like cosmetics so like you wouldn't find this like on the soap aisle you would find it like where like Burt's Bees and like Shea Moisture and like African black soap and stuff like that um, like the Castile body body uh, wash all of those types of things is where you would find the Dr. Squatch um, it says men's natural soap I wish it didn't say men's I wish it just said natural soap but that's <laughs> that's on them um, this is Alaskan glacier mineral clay there's no grit zero grit it says um, lather up this cold press soap and scrub down daily great for all skin types ingredients are olive oil palm sustainable palm oil coconut oil shea butter natural fragrances Alaskan glacier mineral clay indigo powder uh, Carolyn clay and sea salt it says it is made from natural oils no harsh chemicals cold process and sustainably sourced um, so yeah these are great I would definitely recommend these um, because it has shea butter in it they um, make your skin feel really nice my husband says that his skin always feels like really nourished and moisturized um, so yeah this soap is really great love that um, there's also one called like Sudsy Bear that he orders online and he really likes it as well um, so Dr. Squatch and Sudsy Bear are the soaps um, that he likes to use and then he also um, he's like extremely allergic to uh, poison ivy and poison oak poison sumac and then even Virginia creeper and people will say you can't be allergic to Virginia creeper yeah you can <laughs> because my husband is and like he can see the stuff and then just break out terribly and the bad thing about it is like if he gets it in one spot like it goes everywhere it's terrible I don't like I can go like if we if if him or my son my middle or my oldest if any of them like see it they'll come and tell me and I'll have to go and and get it down because I'm not, it doesn't affect me like that but we found this lady uh, local to us well she's kind of local she's about two hours away um, but she goes to a lot of the craft shows that we attend and she actually makes this like poison ivy soap and um, so he uses that like when he's been out uh, like doing yard work or something like that or if he thinks he's been exposed so yeah anyway <laughs> moving on um, this is uh, my husband's favorite like beard product um, this is the Mountaineer Mountaineer brand magic beard balm um, it has citrus and spice 100% natural magic beard balm citrus and spice remove desired amount of product with thumbnail and rub it into palms of your hands until it's dissolved apply to beard yada yada this smells wonderful it smells great um, it is just a balm um, so there's no color or anything like that but I love the smell of this and like it doesn't it doesn't even smell as good here as it does when it's like in his beard um, so anyway I just kind of wanted to show these couple of products um, because you know this is skincare also uh, and hair care and so it's definitely uh, on trend for me to talk about skincare and hair care um, and like I said those are my husband's products uh, he's used those and loves those and would 100% recommend those and if I had a beard uh, I would use the beard balm too uh, and I do occasionally use the soap usually um, I mean like I have my own soaps and stuff but I have on occasion uh, used those soaps so 
Okay. Um, this was Walmart. This was purchased on Amazon. I think I said that, but just to be sure. But you can also purchase this on Amazon. So, like, if you're just on Amazon and you want to get both of these things and try them or give them to someone else and have them try them, that's where you would go. Okay. So, this I picked up when I was at Walmart earlier today. Um, this is the OGX Pure uh, Beauty Pure and Simple. It is silicone free. This is the Hydrating Moisture and Shea Soft and Smooth Body Wash. Decadent Aroma. Hydrate your skin with a rich blend of shea butter, agave, and coconut oil. It leaves skin incredibly moisturized and lightly scented with notes of vanilla and a warm, decadent, frosted treat. Excuse me, this smells wonderful. It smells like... It smells like, uh, like cupcakes. Or like vanilla frosting. <laughs> it smells delicious. Um, so I'm really excited to, to use this. Um, Cash, my oldest, smelled it and he was like, um... No, that's 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 not good. But my husband, my husband liked it. So yeah, I enjoy the scent. I really like the scent, um, and I look forward to using this. Um, I guess maybe that's good because if Cash doesn't like the smell of it, then they won't um, they won't use it. <laughs> so yeah. Next, this is at Walmart. Pick this up at Walmart. This is something I got from Amazon, um, and I'm super excited about it because the reviews on this were great. There we go. This is the Pit Puri. So instead of potpourri, it's Pit Puri. Uh, pits and Bits All Day All Over Deodorant. So you can use this anywhere. Um, coconut Vanilla Sandalwood. Uh, it is sensitive, skin safe. Um, it is paraben free, synthetic fragrance free, plastic free, aluminum free. So yeah, um, this is the same company that makes poo free, like the spray. And I'm super excited about this. Oh, there we go. I pushed it up. So it has a really nice scent, and it is. It doesn't feel like greasy or anything like that. Um, I, I think I've said this before and I even have like videos on it. But I do use natural deodorants um, because I have extremely sensitive skin I use under my arms. And a lot of stuff. Um, most things actually. I only have like two deodorants that I can use under my arms that doesn't break me out. Even natural deodorants uh, a lot of times. Uh, will cause me to have like irritation and, and I have a reaction to them. So I'm super excited to try this. Um, I had just like I don't, I don't I can't even remember what I was looking for and I saw this and I was like oh my god I've got to have that. Uh, planet loving packaging is uh, plastic free. So not only does the deodorant not have plastic in it um, because that's an ingredient in a lot of deodorants but the tube is completely um, cardboard. So, like, this is cardboard. This is cardboard. It doesn't twist. You, like, push it. You push it up. Like, I push. It's, <laughs> it's like a push pop. Um, you push it up. It's got a wonderful scent. So, I'm super excited about that. I can't wait to try it and use it. It says, Pit Puri. I'm sorry. Stinky Pits giving you fits. <laughs> That's cute. I wanted to read that. Pit Puri is a funk-defying, all-natural, full-body deodorant that is clinically proven to work, like for real. Its powerful, skin-loving combination of mandelic acid, prebiotics, caffeine, and proprietary funk lock technology keeps the funk away and keeps you smelling fresh all day. Simply apply anywhere you're smelly and funky, under arms, under boobs, and even your undercarriage. Hello, <laughs> um, dermatologist and gynecologist approved. Gynecologist approved. That's wonderful. You've got to love that. So I'm super excited to try this out. Super excited. I can't wait um, to try that out. Me dropping it is no indication of how much I cannot wait to try that product. <laughs> 
Okay, moving right along. Also got this on Amazon. This is actually a pack. I'm super excited about this. It is a four-piece pack. Oh, it's not going to... Okay, so it's face stamps and eyeliner. And I don't use eyeliner. I mean, I don't really care about eyeliner. I'm not a huge fan. I mean, I may try to... I might I might try this just to at least review that the um, eyeliner portion of it. But I'm not a huge eyeliner fan. However, <laughs> if I can stamp a moon, a flower, a star, or a heart to my face easily, just stamp it instead of having to like draw it on, I'm there for it. So I'm super excited about these. This is what they look like. This is what the pins look like. Um, double eyeliner. Okay, cool. So it shows you, like, that says stamp. I know it's not, um, focusing, but that says, st see, there we go, stamp. That says stamp. That's the stamp end. This is the eyeliner end. Uh, so super excited. I assume that this one is the stars. Yeah, because it has stars on it. This one is the moon. That one's the moon, so it's got a little moon on it. Uh, EVPCT, I guess that's the that's the company. Um, this one is the flowers. Yep, yeah, that one's flowers, and that one's hearts. So which one do I want to do? I have hearts on my shirt, so let me try this heart one. Um, make sure I'm opening the stamp. Turn it around. Let's do this side so that I don't. Let me look and see. I can't tell if it's, I just can't see it from the, hmm, yeah. Let's try this side. This side might do better. Yeah, I'll definitely have to play around with it. See how it's got the, the, the ring around it? Normally you wouldn't see that. Maybe I just pressed too hard the first time. So yeah, I'm definitely going to have to play with that. Oh yeah, that one came out. So that one came out almost perfect. So yeah, I do like those and I'll definitely be playing around with those. I'm sure my youngest uh, will love those as well. Uh, um, my oldest may even enjoy those. And the last product, um, this is also from Amazon. I got this on Amazon. Oh, there we go. No, nope, still not going to pick it up. Okay, so this is from Essence. Uh, Essence is a really great um, drugstore. <laughs> drugstore is the word I'm looking for. A really great drugstore brand. Um, I have some of their makeup products. Like, my favorite mascara is Essence. It's the Essence Lash Princess. It's my favorite mascara. Um, and this is Essence, and they make a lot of, they have like blush, all kinds of makeup and stuff like that. Uh, but this is a milky face moisturizer, so I'm excited to use their skincare, because I don't, I, I'm, I'm trying to think back, and I don't think I've ever used any of Essence skincare. Uh, but this is Hello Good Stuff. There we go. Milky face moisturizer, calming and hydrating with turmeric. Um, it is 96% natural ingredients. There are no silicones, um, microplastic particles, mineral oils, parabens, pegs. I don't, or maybe PEGs. I don't, I don't know. That's kind of, I don't know what that is. Um, but yeah, it doesn't have any of those things. <laughs> um, but let's see. It says milky face moisturizer with turmeric and 96% natural ingredients is calming and refreshing your skin. Lightweight lotion with hydrating oat water and soothing aniline. Uh, apply to clean skin. Ideal base for makeup. So that's cool. Um, I will probably, and it is a little pump. It's a pump. It's, I mean, I just want to see what the consistency is like. Because it's weird to me that it's a pump. Oh, there we go. Okay, I got some out. I don't really smell anything. Um, and it's, and it's kind of like a, it is very much a milky, um, 
a milky texture. So I will just put a little bit in my super dry areas because I, I mean I already have skincare on. By the way, I was able to use a couple of the products from that Pacifica set that I got that I did the video on yesterday. If you haven't watched it, definitely go and do that. It was a Pacifica unboxing for the for uh, like a set that I got. Um, so that's really cool. And I will be doing a review of that um, after I've had a chance to use all the products. So far, I've only used two of the products. But this is okay. I like this. Like I said, there's not a scent. Um, which is fine. I don't mind things that are not scented. Uh, calming and hydrating. Those are definitely two things that I look for in skincare. Something that's going to calm any irritation that I might have. And then something that's going to hydrate my dry skin. So that's good. Love that. So yeah, that's it. Um, so again, from Amazon, I got the um, Essence uh, Milk Moisturizer. I got the four pack of four. It's like it was like a four pack um, of the stencil set. So I look forward to trying those some more. Um, we got the freckle pen, which I know I love because that was a repurchase. Um, we got the body wash that I can't wait to use because it smells great. Love that. Um, we got the deodorant. I dropped that, so I'm not going to... Well, I'll grab it. We got the deodorant. <laughs> we got the um, deodorant that I'm super excited about using. And we got the soap and the beard balm. So again, these come highly recommended by my husband. I did ask him... Uh, his opinion about these uh, before I did the video because I told him that I was going to mention these things in the video uh, but I also have an opinion and I think they both smell wonderful <laughs> like I said this he's been using this beer balm for a while uh, and it's something that he uses every day and when I tell you that his beard smells amazing like all the time it's because of this um, like I said it's like a citrus and spice um, it smells wonderful. So, yes. I would 100% recommend these. Um, and, yeah, I look forward to trying these new products. And just like with any product that is new to me, uh, when I buy it, after I've had a chance to kind of use it, I will do a review. Um, so, yeah, I look forward, uh, you know, to doing those videos for you in the future. And I look forward to uh, reviewing these products. I'm going to recycle... Um, this packaging and finish my smoothie because it's delicious um, I will probably do another video at least one or two more videos today because we're gonna have a lot going on so today Saturday and tomorrow Sunday are gonna be like the list of the busy days I guess yesterday was super busy like last night um, my youngest it was her birthday she had a friend over um, and my husband and my oldest and my middle, they all had a, um, a D and D game on discord online. Um, so there's that. Um, so it was pretty busy and crazy here. And then, like I said, I was cleaning until like nine o'clock. Um, so yeah, last night was crazy. Yesterday was crazy. Um, my daughter had volleyball this morning. Then my husband and I, uh, went shopping and then my oldest has already left to go to work. I cleaned house a little bit earlier today too. Um, so I don't have anything planned for the rest of the evening except uh, doing a couple videos. Um, I'm going to smoke, which is what I'm doing uh, as soon as I get done with this video. Um, yeah, I'm going to do that because I haven't done that today. Um, I am going to watch the Olympics. I'm going to finish up the Olympics. Um, and, like, I have a lot of things that are, like, recorded, like, different events and things. And I love, um, we have YouTube TV. And one thing that I love about it is, like, if I tell it to do ice skating, it's going to record everything that has to do with ice skating. But then it will also record, like, like, it will show, like, it'll have these, like, three to five minute recordings. Sometimes they're a little bit longer depending, but it's like specific people and like their run. And so that's really cool. Like if you don't want to sit and watch 
like all of curling, you can watch like your country or you can watch just the winner. And those are like little five minute runs. So those are super cool. Um, I like that. I, I like that it does that. I don't remember it doing that for the Summer Olympics, um, but it definitely did that, and and it was a it was great, it was great that it did it um, because like I would say um, at the beginning when the Olympics first started, I said you know I want to watch figure skating and snowboarding and skiing uh, and bobsled, and so those are the things that I put in, and then any event uh, that kind of correlates to that. Uh, I have all of those recorded. So, of course, a lot of it I have watched. Some of it I won't get around to. Um, but I do love that that was an option to set it up that way, to record that way. That way I could watch it, you know, whenever I got a chance. So, yeah. Um, I hope that you do something today or this evening, whenever. hope you do something today that gives back to you. Um, because you are important, um, and if you're off on the weekends or whatever your off days are, off days are a wonderful day for self-care, um, you know, because you are probably worn out from the week you've been having. Uh, so, I, again, I encourage you uh, to do some type of self-care, whether that's, you know, making yourself a smoothie, uh, drinking your water, uh, you know, going out and buying yourself something nice. Uh, trying out a product you haven't used, uh, doing fun things with your makeup. Uh, I, I took these off. Uh, you know, doing fun things with your makeup, whatever that self-care looks like to you, I encourage you to do that um, because you're important. You deserve it.